AI could never replace a classroom teacher, or could it? We're gonna dig into the latest research in this episode. Welcome to Safe and Innovative Schools. I'm Dr. Joe Phillips, and today we're gonna to be talking about, will AI ever replace a classroom teacher? Now, six months ago, my mind was set and I was absolutely firm that in no way possible could AI ever replace the classroom teacher, that human connection, what it takes to actually understand students and get to deep learning. But new research that has come out in the last few months has got me wondering, has got me questioning this premise. Uh, I'm not going to say I'm all the way there yet, but we're going to dig into this research and see what's emerging in the field. The idea of robots or computers or AI being able to teach our students is not new. The education system goes back a little over 100 years, and as soon as 1926, a guy by the name of Sidney Presley introduced the first teaching machine with some multiple choice uh, quizzes and tests and that type of thing, and it really was an early attempt to automate learning. It did not gain traction. And then in 1954, B.F. Skinner developed a more structured reinforcement-based automated learning system. It also did not take off. Why? Well, both systems got strong resistance from educators and they lacked widespread funding. While they were innovative ideas at the time, they just didn't catch on. In the decades since, we've seen more computer-based learning experiments. These things have been attempted and most of the time they've had limited success. It's the story of computers will replace the teacher, we try it, and it fails. And we've really seen this emerging theme come about with all of this experimentation, and that is deep learning has always required human teachers, those talented, proficient, and caring educators who guide and inspire students in the teaching and learning process. But now the latest research is showing that AI is actively changing how students learn and it's happening fast. Studies show that AI tutors are actually outperforming traditional teaching and learning methods in several areas. From real-time feedback to personal learning paths, AI is reshaping classrooms worldwide. As a result, we're no longer asking if AI is gonna impact education. We're asking how, how much and how fast AI is gonna impact classrooms worldwide. And as educational leaders, we are facing critical questions. Will AI enhance teaching, allowing educators to be more effective while reducing administrative burden and tasks? Or are we up against a fundamental shift where AI replaces the teaching and learning process as we know it? The traditional model is breaking and AI is really stepping in to help out. For over a century, Education has followed the same structure. A teacher instructs a group of students at a set pace with limited flexibility. And for decades, researchers and educators have tried to overcome the limitations of this system. The most obvious being that students learn at different speeds, but they're often taught with a one-size-fits-all approach. At the same time, teaching itself is becoming unsustainable in many places across the country. Teacher shortages have reached a crisis level with over 270,000 teachers leaving the profession in the U.S. every year. Teacher burnout is accelerating due to heavy workloads, student discipline issues, administrative burdens, and increasing expectations. And the post-pandemic recovery that many educational leaders expected to happen is just not happening in many schools across the country. And so these districts are struggling to fill these vacant teaching positions. Meanwhile, AI is stepping in to address some of these challenges by offering personalized adaptive learning at scale that human teachers alone just can't match. Okay, so what does the literature, what does the most recent research say about all of this? Well, it says that AI is transforming education. So this Harvard study shows that AI tutors more than doubled learning gains. The study found that students using AI-powered tutors learn twice as much than those in traditional lecture-based settings. AI provided real-time feedback and adapted to individual learning styles, leading to significant improvements in engagement and retention. This Stanford study showed that AI can help tutors teach more effectively. It was a large-scale study of an app called Tutor Copilot 
with 900 tutors and 1,800 students, and researchers found that AI-assisted tutoring led to higher mastery levels, especially among those struggling students. In this Nigerian study, students used AI-driven instruction and achieved learning gains equivalent to two years of traditional education in just six weeks. AI adapted lessons dynamically based on student performance, making instruction far more efficient. This unidistance Swiss study showed that AI boosted student grades by 15%. It was a semester-long study at Unidistance Suisse, and it used AI tutors to generate personalized micro-learning questions. Students who engaged with this AI tool saw great improvements of, again, 15 percentile points compared with the students who did not use AI. So what can these AI tutors do? Well, AI-driven education is more than just automated grading or simple question answering systems. The latest AI tutors are highly sophisticated and capable of transforming learning in multiple ways. Delivering fully adaptive instruction where AI can customize lessons in real time based on student performance, learning style, and pace. Identifying learning gaps and misconception where AI can detect patterns in student errors and help teachers intervene before students fall behind. Personalized learning pathways where AI curates custom lesson plans, exercises, and resources based on each student's strengths and weaknesses. And it can generate practice questions and explanations where it creates new questions at different difficulty levels based on each student's strengths and weaknesses. It can also simulate one-on-one -on -one tutoring where chatbots and virtual tutors respond to students' inquiries, mimicking real-time instruction. Importantly, it can also support multiple learning modalities where the AI can integrate text, video, interactive exercises, and simulations to engage different types of learners in different ways. It can also provide real-time performance analytics where we can track progress, suggest areas for improvement, and set up active alerts for educators for those students that are needing extra help. AI can also enhance accessibility with speech-to-text, text-to-speech, and language translation tools, making learning more inclusive for students with disabilities or with language barriers. It also allows for the scaling of high-quality education where one-on-one -on -one tutoring can happen at scale, making personalized instruction available to more students, especially in those areas where there is teacher shortages. So we can imagine an AI-backed tutor that learns each student and can travel from grade to grade with each student, really learning how this student learns best and working hand-in-hand -hand with the teacher to make sure that the student is actually grasping and mastering content before moving on to the next section. That is a game changer. Traditionally in education, we have had to move the pack along whether all students mastered content or they didn't. And if they didn't master the concepts at the first section and had to move on and then move on and then move on again, they kept falling further and further behind. That's where AI can really come in and help differentiate that instruction and bring all the students along together. So we're seeing that AI can get precision targeted instruction for each student and that that targeted instruction designed and catered to each student is able to more effectively and efficiently teach that student and get them to a mastery of content. So the question is, is that human connection, that inspiration, that ability that human teachers have to connect with students and bring them along into deep learning, is something that was needed in this one-size-fits-all approach where you're moving the group along as a group in overcoming the inability to specifically target each student. And now that AI can specifically target each student, is that human connection still needed for that deep learning to occur? Well, I've been chatting with a lot of experts in education and AI, as well as my LinkedIn network, and the current consensus is that despite its advantages, AI is still not proven to fully replace human teachers. And while AI tutors can excel at personalized instruction, real-time feedback, and adaptive learning, they currently lack many of the qualities that define great educators. Mentorship, emotional intelligence, and the ability to inspire students. 
But again, is that needed when you have targeted precision teaching and learning designed for each student where we basically have a school of one? Or was that needed in a group setting in order to have that relationship with each student so that you could pull them together as a group. The thing is, AI is evolving rapidly and we find ourselves facing some substantial questions. Could AI reshape what it means to be a teacher? Instead of viewing AI as a replacement, should we see it as a tool that shifts the educator's role? Or is AI gonna turn all of our teachers into superhero teachers? where they have the knowledge, skills, and ability in order to match that human connection that we believe is so powerful and needed for deep learning to occur and partner it with this precision school of one approach. And so we really have the best of both worlds blending together while also having AI take off a lot of the administrative burden from teachers and allowing them to really do what they do best, the teaching and learning process. So basically, are teachers now going to be able to be facilitating and focusing on mastery of content as opposed to the actual content delivery itself? The truth is AI is here to stay. And I believe that the overall emerging question is, how should schools and teachers adapt? How can we leverage, how can we use this technology to make the teaching and learning process more efficient, more effective, so that we can shift from the aggregated quantitative measure of every student to really being able to focus on the success of each student. Six months ago, I would have said, no way, no chance AI could never replace the classroom teacher. But the new studies that are coming out, the apps that I have seen, we're seeing new capabilities emerge. We're seeing an adoption rate of AI that is really, really high. And I'll be honest, it's got me pondering, it's got me thinking, it's got me exploring this and other fundamental ideas. Things that I held true for years, I'm now wondering about. Thank you for joining this episode of Safe and Innovative Schools, where we really started to ask the question, what is the role of AI in the teaching and learning process? If you like this and other episodes, please like and subscribe, share with your colleagues, and until next time, let's keep building safe and innovative learning environments. Thank you. Thank you.